There's a term you're going to hear thrown around frequently with regard to retrieving, and it's a general dog training principle called back chaining. And back chaining is simply when we start a behavior chain from the end and work backwards. And a behavior chain is a series of behaviors that are different from each other, that are strung together into one larger behavior. And typically, back chaining starts at the end, and retrieving is a perfect example. If your dog is going to retrieve formally, then the order in which the dog's going to perform these operations are my dog would sit next to me, I would throw an object or drop an object, I would tell the dog to go get it, the dog would get it, pick it up, and return to me with the object. And that's the order in which the dog's going to perform those behaviors. Back chaining would be teaching the same sequence of behaviors backwards, starting at the end of the chain and working back through the chain. So I would teach the dog to hold an object in front of me, and then bring it to me, and then bring it from further away, then pick up and bring it to me, etc., until the dog works all the way back to my side and will go out, get an object, and bring it to me. By teaching it backwards from end to front, then each time we teach a new behavior, it's being installed in front of a behavior that the dog already knows how to perform. And the benefit of back chaining is that you don't break other pieces of your behavior chain while teaching new ones. New ones are always added in front of behaviors that the dog is already fluent in. And it's a great technique for teaching retrieve. Easy. Yes. Easy. 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 Easy.